प्लीज सब्सक्राइब रमजान बयालू जी पर नेक्स्ट लेक्चर प्लीज सब्सक्राइब लाइक एंड शेयर रमजान विद द नेम ऑफ अल्लाह व्हिच इज द मोस्ट मर्सीफुल एंड द मोस्ट बेनिफिशिएंट अस्सलाम वालेकुम डियर स्टूडेंट टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट द नेक्स्ट द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक ऑफ द हाइड्रोकार्बन और द ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री व्हिच इज द अल्केन सो अल्केन इज आल्सो ए हाइड्रोकार्बन व्हिच इज ए सैचुरेटेड हाइड्रोकार्बन सो वी टॉक अबाउट द अल्केन Alkane is a saturated hydrocarbon that contain only single covalent bond. Other hydrocarbon contain uh, double covalent bond, triple covalent bond. We will talk about this uh, later. But this our today topic is alkane. So the alkane contain single bond, and their part due to a single bond, it is a saturated. It mean that their is no any addition of other element in it and it is completed its bond are completed because we say that carbon uh, carbon um, carbon form four covalent bond so and the alkane but carbon have permit four covalent bond and there is no uh, any chance of other fa- bond formation so there part we say that alkane is a saturated hydrocarbon okay they are also called paraffin the word paraffin mean paramin paramin little and pin mean affinity so this is a hydrocarbon which have a little affinity for bonding with other element it means that if it uh, it it form bonding with other element so it have little affinity and there is no chance of bonding with other element Their general molecular formula is CN H two N plus two. It means the N means number number of carbon. N mean number of carbon. So the alkane are represented by the CN H two N plus two. So you can see here that these are the some formulas molecular formulas of the alkane these are methane ch4 so in this case there is only one carbon so if we apply this formula so we say that c c is 1 number is 1 and the h we put 2 and in the place of n we put 1 and then plus 2 so it will give us c h 4 and on this way if we put this as 2 so it will give us c2 h6 which is ethane and then we put 3 so it give us c3 h8 which is propane so on this way it form bonding so you can see here this is a structural formula molecular formula of the uh, uh, pentane you can see here there are five carbon so in pentane there are five carbon and 12 hydrogen so every carbon is attached with four covalent bond one with three with the hydrogen atom and one with the uh, another carbon and if we see this carbon so they have two uh, carbon at uh, bond and two hydrogen bond and this way there are 12 ca- uh, hydrogen and five carbon and we say it uh, is pentane if we talk about the uh, naming the alkane these three uh, rules are only for the straight chain like this is a straight chain so these three rules are only for a straight chain not for the cyclic or only are branched you talk about uh, the uh, an other uh, naming culture of the alkane in our next lecture okay so in straight chain first rule is count number of carbon atoms the first in the first rule is call that we have to count the number of carbon how many there are the carbon a carbon number so and this you can see here this is ch4 so there is only one carbon so meet the me mean only one it means two proof mean three and both mean both mean 
a four and fent mean five. So on this way, the first name, the first name for the alkane is given by the counting the number of carbon. Second, use prefixes meth, eight, prof. So on this way, if we count the number of carbon, so we will give it as meth these firstly prefixes okay and so going on if we talk about a uh, hexane so uh, heptane octane nonane decane and so on the third one is the end the name by using a and e as greek suffixes so the first name was given on the virtue of carbon number but the second name in in is common in everyone so this is this represent the single covalent bond of the alkane. This represent the single covalent bond of the alkane. So therefore, the rule say that end the name, the methane, ethane, that end this name with using the prefix, the uh, suffix uh, n and the end and give it a, a pull name. So the first First prefix is given by the counting the number of carbon. The second is given by the virtue of single covalent bond and the alkane. And while in the alkene and alkane, it is changed because their uh, bonding is changed because in the alkene there is a double bond, while the alkane there is a triple bond. So therefore, their suffix is changed by E and Y. Next, we will talk about another topic. Next, we will talk about the division of the alkane. So, alkane or the open chain or the stride chain hydrocarbon, but there are also some ring-like structure alkane which are called cycloalkane. So, these are the alkanes in which carbon atoms are arranged in a ring or cyclic structure. Okay. So, like... When carbon is arranged in this ring-like structure, so it can is a cycloalkane. There are no pre and carbon atoms. So you can see here that in this example, this is a, a cycle, this is a, a propane. So when we take it as a cyclo Propane. So in this case, you can see that there is no, there is no free and carbon atom. You can see here all the carbon atoms are bonded with the hydrogen. While in simple stride chain alkane, there were the carbon which were bonded into hydrogen. You can see here. But there is a ring-like structure, so therefore there are no pre and carbon atoms. They uh, have two less hydrogen than open chain alkane. So in this case, their molecular formula is CN2N and the uh, simple alkane was the CN H2N plus 2 while there the addition of 2 is removed and there is only CNH2N. So in this case, we say that the cycloalkane have to less hydrogen than the simple stride chain alkane. So therefore, they have to less hydrogen than the open chain alkane. So you can see here, this is example of cyclo assemble of propane, open chain stride propane, while this is a cyclo, right, is a cyclo propane. So you can see here, we say that in the propane there are three hydrogen, and eight carbon, eight, eight, uh, three carbon and eight hydrogen. So this is a stride chain. While if we see there, so there are no the complete set of uh, the complete set of hydrogen atoms. So therefore, we say that they have two less hydrogen than the open chain alkane and therefore they are started from the propane because in order to make a chain line structure therefore we cannot made, make from uh, ethane a chain line structure so therefore from propane we start a cycloalkane and this is an example of cyclobutane so you can see here in the cyclobutane there are 
फोर कार्बन एन टेन हाइड्रोजन बट इन दिस केस देर आर एट हाइड्रोजन यू कैन सी हेयर देर आर एट हाइड्रोजन सो देर पार दे आर रिड्यूस बाई टू हाइड्रोजन फ्राम दी सिंपल ओपन चेन अल्केन सो देर पार साइक्लो अल्केन हैव टू लेस हाइड्रोजन देन दी ओपन चेन अल्केन सो नेक्स्ट यूर टाक अबाउट दिन अदर टॉपिक The next, let me cut the wrong. The next one is the alkyl radical. So alkyl radical is a palm of the alkane in which a one hydrogen is removed from the uh, open chain, start chain alkane, and give us the alkyl radical. So alkyl radical is a group of atoms that is formed by removing a hydrogen from an alkane molecule. So when we remove a hydrogen atom from an alkane molecule, so it gives us alkyl. Like if I take one uh, alkane, this is uh, this is me. Uh, this is ethane. So ethane have hydrogen so if i remove this one hydrogen from here one hydrogen from here so then this is this is not called as alkane this is called as a alkyl radical because it have it it have less a uh, one hydrogen atom from an alkane because we removed one hydrogen from the uh, open chain alkane straight chain alkane it is represented by r so this alkyl radical now we call it a is a alkyl group and it is represented by r so therefore if you touch the this whole ch uh, c2 h5 to any a uh, alkane so we call it a is alkyl radical like if i take air as a this is a carbon this is a carbon this is another carbon so when i touch it a this is hydrogen this is also hydrogen this is hydrogen and there i touch the ch5 so i will call as a R group, R group. So therefore, I will call as a R R group. R group mean alkyl radical, and I will say that which one alkyl group, which one R group. So I will mention it name. It is methyl alkyl, etc. So it is represented by R. The la the last A N of alkane is replaced by. Uh, is replaced by yl so just like we say alkane so there will call is a alkyl alkyl in alkane we say alkane the last one is a and e so now there we will say alkyl we will replace a and e by yl just like you can see here methane so methane will change as a methyl and Their general formula is CN H two N plus one. So the general formula of alkane was the there was the two in place of one there was two. But there one is not present and there is only one hydrogen. So therefore we call that the alkyl radical have one hydrogen less than the general uh, uh, straight chain of the chain formula of the alkane so you can see here this methane change into methyl and there was a ch4 while there is ch3 one hydrogen is removed from the methane so it gave us uh, methyl and the ethane it gave us ethyl and one hydrogen is removed it gave us there is ch2h6 while there is ch2h5 and the propane there is ch3h8 and the propyl there is a c3 h7 so this was all about the alkyl radical that it is the uh, removing part of the hydrogen ion from a alkane so it gave us the alkyl radical from an alkane so this was about the alkane so i hope that this lecture may be helpful to you and if you have any doubt any question so me uh, mention in the comment and please subscribe and share my lecture for next video see you next
प्लीज सब्सक्राइब रमजान बयालू जी पर नेक्स्ट लेक्चर प्लीज सब्सक्राइब लाइक like,